Hey guys, Dusty Baker with Cross Timbers Bison. Got an unexpected surprise today. Woo, I can't believe this is happening. Um, just wait and see. So my mom called me yesterday and uh, she said, check your Snapchat. And I was like, ah, I'm not very good at checking Snapchat. And um, she goes, you got a new baby. And so um, where I was at, I had no service. So I didn't even get to see the video until I got back home. But um, as soon as I opened it up, I was super excited. We have a new baby on the ground for 2020. It's one of our original herds, our very first herd. Uh, my feisty heifer, Bill Star, has had her first baby. I'm out in the pasture. I've got Marissa's brother with me, Austin. Austin's hanging out. He's uh, he hadn't got to see the bison really much at all. It's gonna be his first time to see a calf. But what we uh, I parked. I I see him down here in the pasture, but uh, I don't know where she is and I don't know where the baby is. So just to be on the safe side, it's her first time having a baby. Um, we are gonna send up the drone and take a look and. Uh, check her from a distance so really excited i'm really pumped we thought eleanor uh sweet little eleanor is gonna have a baby first but it's uh it's not eleanor bell star and so here we go we're gonna check her out can tell the baby seems to be doing great um, just a really just kind of a surprise uh, Bell Star was showing signs um, a couple of things is I, I brought a group of people out and we stood um, at the fence and the bison came up to us and we were feeding them cubes and whatnot and um, Bell Star kept a distance she she got within about 50 yards from us and she she stayed far away from us so 
I was like, huh, that's weird because she always comes up and gets cubes, but she didn't. And uh, then my mom calls yesterday and um, says, hey, um, you got a baby bison. And um, so it's just really exciting because it's one of my first five. I started out with five. I've got one bull and four heifers. And um, this is our feisty one, Bell Star. So it's just, it's just exciting to have you finally start to see you know basically you know a couple years of work uh, finally come to life because it takes these bison so long they can't breed until they're two and then they have a uh takes a you know nine or ten months to uh, carry that baby and then have that calf and so it's been a long time in the making but we finally have our first original herd baby bison um, remember i had two calves i bought two bred heifers in um 20 uh the fall of 2018 and uh, they had their calf um, but this is just different because it's from my original herd it's from my first um my first herd so anyways um you can tell that the calf is doing great seems to be doing fine um, now we're just uh gonna keep an eye on it we're gonna stay um kind of a give her some distance uh we we'll just stand on the back of the atv checking on them we're not gonna go in the uh this lot Matter of fact, this is this is the new lot um, that I built. Uh, if you go back and see a couple of my videos, um, but so they're just hanging out. And uh, what I love about it uh, is these bison kind of gravitate as a family around each other um, when they have a baby. And um, my mom and Kevin, um, Kevin who helps do a lot of work for me and take care of the bison, he was actually the first one to see. Uh, the baby yesterday and um, he he, uh, he was out doing some stuff and and, and saw her and um, kind of a surprise to us uh, but um, you know that's okay it's a, we're right in the middle of the season uh, for for uh, calving season for bison so just really excited now we've got Eleanor and we should have peaches and then I have um, one of our cows um, Dakota sorry not Dakota Quapaw that should have um, some more babies so you know, this kind of this may get some things going with uh, with her having a baby now. Eleanor should be next. Bellstar had her baby. We don't know what it is yet. Kevin, um, when he was pretty close to it um, yesterday because he found it, um, he thinks it's a heifer. And I hope to gosh it's a heifer. Bellstar is a really good looking heifer, and I like her confirmation. I like the way she looks, and uh, I hope that it's a heifer because remember we want to build this herd and um we can do that by having heifers and i i just hope that she is and we're not going to get too close to her we're going to give her some time and you know when she comes up close to us maybe we'll be able to see if it's a heifer or a bull Ugh, i hope it's a heifer um but the red dog is here is what you call them these calves uh, when they come out they're not brown like uh, mom and dad they are uh, this red cinnamon color as you can kind of tell and um, they're called red dogs so um, we have our first red dog of 2020. hope you guys enjoyed the video today there's a lot of work that goes into a farm especially working with bison you guys follow me you've seen the transformation um and uh this is the result right here is you finally get to have a red dog um, part of the family that new bison calf and um, can't can't wait to see the others and for them to to join uh, to join the herd but um, I know you probably want to see some up close to that to that baby but not yet we'll get some uh, up close shots and we'll get a lot closer to that baby pretty soon but we're just gonna give them some time uh, this uh, she just had the baby yesterday um, we're thinking kind of in the afternoon or so um, but uh, so we're just gonna give her some distance and let her do her thing and let that baby really get all that uh, colostrum and that good milk from mama uh, to get going thank you guys for following if you haven't hit that subscribe button and follow us uh, you can follow us on Instagram and Facebook um, I'll be shooting some of this uh, these, these babies hopefully lots of lots of babies here soon but i'm gonna start um you know once we give her a couple of days we'll uh we'll get a lot of good shots of the baby and so stay with us because the next couple of videos um we'll, we should have some more babies um join the cross timbers bison farm 
Thank you guys.